Hello everyone. Many of my clients have been uh, going in for the yearly charts uh, as of now and uh, this year I saw a real spurt of the clients who are interested in making the yearly charts and going for month by month guidance. It's very well and I really appreciate and I'm uh, humbled that I am able to guide you and you all have the full faith in me. But now here I need to let my apprise my uh, clients or let the clients know of one major thing that is you are most more than welcome to get your yearly charts made and get the monthly guidance. This definitely helps you a lot in your planning, in your scheduling, in probably taking the major decisions of life and also knowing when to lie low and when to do great things for yourself. But before we talk about the beautiful uh, building of our life, Let's talk about the foundation. It's very important for every individual to get their natal charts made, which is the birth analysis of yourself. Now, once you come to know what are the positive negatives or your attitudes which will determine your altitudes and what are the basic potential and talents in you and how you can incorporate them in your daily life, will the personalized yearly and monthly chart help? Once that foundation of having your natal chart made has been laid, then going for subsequently like knowing what are the Mahadashas, how they are affecting you, how are the yogas affecting you or how are the Antardashas affecting you, that is the sub-periods or how can you plan your year or how can you actually be guided month by month is more endorsed, enhanced or um, actually uh, you get a clear picture of how you can do it because knowing about your positive or negatives will only help you choose the correct path. But if you haven't got your birth analysis done or if you haven't got your own, um, I would say the dissection of your own life done, the planning can become a little contradictory or it may not be that helpful because you yourself will be confused that which is the path I should take. Because sometimes when we are talking about the yearly charts or the yearly planetary placements that are affecting you on your psyche, gets very confusing because if you don't know which are the energies that are balanced and imbalanced in your system, then how are you going to handle as to what the planets are trying to convey? So sometimes when people have left out the natal chart, not got their birth analysis done, but have concentrated on just the yearly chart. They have come back and told me that they are confused because they don't know why is a particular planet affecting them the way it is. And that is the time I have to revert back to them saying that please look into your natal charts. And you will realize which is the energy that is balanced and imbalanced in your body and why is a particular planet behaving in a particular way. So now it makes me also feel bad that they have made their personalized chart, the yearly chart, but they have not made their personalized natal chart. So telling them again that please look into the foundations, lay the foundations through your birth chart or your natal chart, then going um, towards or progressing towards the progression and the transits of the planets makes more sense. So my humble plea is for everybody out there, getting your birth chart, your natal chart made, knowing which are the energies balanced or imbalanced in your body, knowing exactly what is it that is impacting you is like laying the foundation of your life and then knowing the progressions of the char of the planets or the transits of the planets or also knowing about your solar returns or your Saturn returns makes more sense to you because you know what the foundation is now how you build your life on that foundation will actually help you become more healthier, wealthier and wiser.